Hi guys, welcome back to my channel Lush Foliage. In today's video, we will be talking about some interesting facts about caladiums. Did you know that there are two types of caladiums in terms of shape? One is fancy leaf caladium and the second one is strap leaf caladium. I will definitely show you both of the differences. Now the major difference is in the placement or the attachment of the petiole of the caladium. Also a little bit of difference in terms of the environment, meaning when they tend to go dormant and non-dormant. So let me quickly show you first one that is the fancy leaf caladium. So this is a fancy leaf caladium. They tend to have a heart shaped leaf with their petioles attached near the middle of the leaf in an upright habit. They are generally more shade tolerant, but some cultivars can handle a bit of morning direct sunlight. I will also attach the image so it will be much easier for you to understand. Now, fancy leaf type caladiums tend to be more sensitive to cold. So they are the ones that are going to hit dormancy as soon as the temperatures start to drop, meaning that they are the ones that will start to shed their leaves as soon as they feel that the environment is getting very cold. So if you are a person who tends to take out the tubers from the soil because of winters, then these are the ones that are going to shed their leaves first compared to the second one. So now we will talk about the second shape of caladiums, which is called as the strap leaf caladiums. Now these caladiums have narrower and arrow shaped leaves with their petioles attached to the edge of the leaf, unlike the first one. And these have more mounded habit. They are generally more tolerant to morning direct sunlight, but can also grow well in indirect bright light. These caladiums, they tend to have a little bit more tolerance towards cold so they are the ones that are going to hit dormancy a little bit later compared to the fancy leafed caladiums but they too will also drop all of the leaves when the temperatures start to drop but it is going to be a little bit later so in both cases whether you have a fancy leaf or a strap leaf both of the caladiums will hit dormancy when the temperatures tend to drop now it completely depends upon you whether you want to leave the tubers in the pot or you want to take them out. It completely depends upon you. If you are from a place wherein you experience snowfall, then of course you will have to take them out from the soil or from the ground. But for me, I'm from a tropical environment. I don't have much of an issue. I leave the tubers in the pot. But you have to be extremely careful that you do not water those pots in which the tubers are hibernating. Otherwise, the tubers will get rotted. So guys, that's about it. I hope that you liked this video. If you did, please hit the like button. And if you're new to my channel, please consider subscribing to it. Until then, take care, stay safe and keep planting.